Hey guys, Luke here. This is episode 31, and uh, this is the semi-finals. So, really important game, and we're taking on London Broncos again. Yes, that is the team that uh, beat us in the first, um, the first finals game. It wasn't elimination, obviously, because we're still in it, but nonetheless, they beat us um, in extra time. I think it was too. Um, a field goal by Dawn, I think, potentially, possibly, uh, probably was Dawn. Um, he picked up. Um, player of the Year as well, the Man of Steel Award, I think. Or maybe he didn't. Uh, but anyways, it's irrelevant. There's going to be a lot more highlights in here. Uh, not particularly just showing the tries, because um, I want the episode to go for more than a minute. So Greg Bird made a nice little run there. Just made a lot of half chances, um, and we didn't turn him into full chances. Um, here's another one here. Brought and got tackled. Um, just had to beat the last defender and pull over. Greg Bird here, put into a nice hole. Um, there has been chances throughout the season where we've finished them. Um, we've wrong-footed the fullback, but this Dawn chap is um, quite good. Really nice kick there. Unfortunately, we couldn't get under the, the bomb, but we did force a uh, repeat set. But then, not too much longer later, Wardle goes in and he gets it to Broughton, and Broughton nine times out of ten scores them, but somehow, uh, I'm not sure who the defender was, but he got there. Then they put up a nice little kick there. Um, it was dropped, but Hodgson grabbed it and brought it out of the end goal, and we survived to half time, nil all. If you look at the stats, we're probably in more control. We've made less tackles, had more possession, but at the same time, we haven't looked very dominating. So Broughton brings the ball back and gets a nice little offload there to Owen, who just ran around, got in great position there. And straight from that, Hodgson. He'll shift the ball out to Paulie Paulie, pushes off one, sour what it looked like. Just draws him past with the fullback. Bruff gets tackled, but and then just a few tackles later. We attack the left hand side and Ryan Hall's taken over touch. Um, great play, but also great defence. Really should have been um, taken. He Watkins. Watkins, can he make it? Yes he does. Nice little run there by Ryan Hall um, initially, but then Watkins finished it very well. Um, he had a lot to do from there. Probably wasn't expecting to try at the time. I thought the dude would have got tackled, but um, nothing, nothing that um, London can do. So we go up six 0 hit ringing chase on the ball, and Watkins is through a hole again. He's very damaging. I've said it before. He's like our Inglis, and he offloads Ryan Hall. He, like Broughton, um, nine times out of ten finishes in those situations, but he just couldn't get there. But then Lloyd Parrott made a break there, and then not too much long later. Uh, I don't know why I said that, but Waddle scored um, in the corner. So here's our shot at goal. Danny Bruff, virtually the sideline. It's coming across, and it goes across the face of goal. Uh, so we missed the goal. Hopefully it doesn't end up too important, but we just uh, can play down the clock here. So Dawn has to go and get it, because um, they don't want to don't want to waste too much time. But that was really the last highlight of the game. And we'll be moving on to the Super League final. Um, super excited for the final. Um, we've worked really hard and I think we deserve it. Just a little disappointing that Leeds aren't going to be in the final because they would be who I prefer to go up against. But we're going to take on Bradford Bulls who aren't a bad side. Um, well, obviously, if they got into the final, they're a pretty good side. Um, I think we've beat them a few times throughout the year. So I'm expecting a win, but we don't want to get too cocky. So here's all the all the stats and stuff from their game, considering like you can't see the game, so just just an idea of who was their best player, so um, Brett Carney or Kearney and Jared Summit were their best. And Zach Hardacre for Lee's looked to have a good game. I'm not sure if he played centre or fullback or what. But that's uh, where we're going to end the episode. Next episode is the big one, the most important game of the whole 32 episodes, 31 episodes. So uh, yeah, hopefully... Hopefully you're there to see it, and hopefully you enjoy it, and I'll see you next time. If you enjoyed the episode, leave a like, subscribe to the channel for more. See you then. Bye.